Exactly how I will be sitting in Shake Shack next Sunday. It's gonna be a feast, man. Food focused. I'm actually pretty worried. I informed my coach Jeff that I will be feasting and beasting on food so uh, we have to come up with a plan actually to uh, prevent massive weight gain oh, four grams come on baby normally we would have stevia and now we are freaking eating pancake sugar powder all things together here with a little bit of powder. <coughs> the powder man. Remember, low carb day. This is a feast. Last milk today. Tomorrow, Dubai. This shit is amazing. Okay, it's about that time. Wednesday, 10th of June. Three days out. It's uh, 5 30 in the morning. So we're gonna see what the weighing skill uh, says today and we're gonna give my coach Jeff an update on the conditioning. It's looking pretty solid here. Hmm. 67.6 Ah, oh. damn. Ah, mm. oh, it's freaking cold. Gonna dig him some good, good breakfast. I'm gonna let you see what uh, we are going to eat, man. Today, today we got uh, instead of 150 carbs, we go to 352 preload uh, for the show and see uh, what my body does and uh, but 350 carbs <gasps> two chickens breasts another 150 grams of cooked white rice gonna bring ourselves one apple one can of beans so that's only for today, right? And I have my whole year protein bar. Mm. I'm gonna miss these breakfasts. Cannot bring me frozen fruits, of course. Can get it in the grocery shop, but hey, just keep things simple. And when we're back home, 
making the best best pizzas Turkish pizzas now everything there is just all about efficiency you know not making the best dishes just do it easy keep it simple just having rice and tuna chicken or whatever we can get in the grocery stores but that may not making these crazy plates ah yes mm. oh lonely so a little bit of pre-dubai acclimatization in the weather in the sun I'm getting pretty hungry so it's time for oh yeah victory candy chocolate chocolate caramel candy bar and now we've been standing up very early so I'm hungry as hell now waiting for my parents of course to be ready and go to Amsterdam Schiphol I wanted to wait to 11 o'clock before I get into a meal. Screw that, man. Mm. Seventeen grams of fat. Three more days ago, I can throw them protein bars away and shuffle down Shake Shack hamburger. Mm. Het is, het is maar een minuut. Dus, uh... to the beans. Three days out. Maar um, oh, dan kun je al de shoulders vragen of ze mij even in de macron voor je rijden. So get everything prepared for the uh, airplane. Now remember, everything is canned. Canned foods. Nothing is prepared myself. Just easy and convenient. No stress. Hungry man. It's 
surviving. I'm gonna stuff myself down with, with black coffee to keep my stomach full, otherwise I'm eating the freaking whole can. The whole Tupperware. It's time to go, baby. Forty five degrees with them gains. Tomato beans. It's really thin. Can't wait to dig in my, my freaking bowl with rice and beans and chicken, tomato sauce. <sighs> Tired. Establishing the womb finally. Was a long flight. Oh, starving as hell as we were getting up very early. So most of our macronutrients we had it already was already done. And uh, so let's see uh, what tomorrow brings. Let's sleep. Tomorrow's Thursday. We're gonna have our last workout and uh, work on our way to the show itself. Looking pretty sharp. Ah. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, tomorrow it's going to start. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Y
dus ik ben een die livestream moet even... Ja, bij elkaar Ja. paar nemen. Ik nog één gek in. Ik heb <laughs> Team Netherlands is ready, baby. So today we are here at Big Daddy's gym and it's an awesome gym on the walls they got Dragon Ball Z figures here a lot of hardcore stuff for a good proper training it was nearby the hotel so very convenient and today we are, this is our last training we are only doing upper body we are just leaving the legs out because we need separation in the legs for the show two days out so we are hitting just very light not very light but just decreasing the intensity of the training itself. Gonna have a pre-workout and you know want to know which one, right? Two double shots Nescafe coffee just plumping into my mouth eating it like a beast. Look, just raw coffee, baby. Very good, very comfortable. But once you walk outside, man, big Just dancing, man. Two days out. Jim, man. It's really awesome.
Shake Shack is waiting. Damn, damn, damn! <sighs> Come on, baby. That's working, Seth. Exercise dumbbell curl, baby. And then we are finished. We can finish our protein bar. Oh, yeah, victory bar. Rawr! Show day, baby. The six month journey is off. Done. So, tomorrow we have rest. Saturday, it's on. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Bodybuilders survive and thrive on white rice and tilapia. Ladies and gentlemen, two days out, we are just digging in a another oh yeah chocolate caramel candy bar. M and M's. It's all good, man. Ten PM, and we are still boosting them coffee gains. Caffeine. Tomorrow registration day. Just chilling, uh, not doing very much actually. It is too warm outside, you know. Just get mentally prepared for the show itself. And uh, Saturday, we'll be doing uh, our thing where we have been training for six solid months. For but first off, we're gonna demolish this freaking nice, nice coffee at 10 p.m., bro. Ah, coffee is so good. 
Stay hard and shredded for the show, baby. Bow! Nothing to worry about. Let me get you some app selfie here. So today we are one day out and we are reporting to Jeff, to my coach, each and every single morning. So we're going to stand on a weighing scale, see what our weight done, and do a quick posing video for my shape to send it over to my coach and uh, wait on his response and have our breakfast. Ladies and gentlemen, 67 and a half kilograms. So, right now I'm getting into the uh, update for Jeff. We have already established the whole camera setup. So, hi Jeff, 67 and a half kilograms this morning, and uh, here's the posing update. Posing trunk on, of course. So let's do this. So this was basically the posing update, I'm gonna send it to him. I'm gonna let him know what we are planning to do for in terms of uh, food today, so. I'm living on canned tuna. So uh, today we are basically eating uh, this cooked rice, um, two barbecue potatoes. So this is actually uh, actually how we communicate with each other right in this point, pre-contest. You know, we are sending over YouTube videos and uh, see how things work out each and every morning. Uh, and that's what I really like. So right now we are heading into our uh, breakfast. Uh, first get some clothes on, it's pretty cold here. I think uh, shape is looking definitely good on point. And uh, yeah. Yesterday we did the, our shaving session, we shaved everything off, feeling strange, if you're gonna do your first show, oh man, you're gonna, you're gonna discuss the feel that you, whenever you're putting on a uh, training pant. So, let's get into the breakfast, breakfast. So we see the update from our coach, Jeff. So we're gonna listen to that right now with our breakfast and coffee here. Yes, yes, yes. Mm. Rico, what's going on, man? It's 11.30 on uh, Thursday here in Dude. Um, gauging by um, the short update in the couple poses that you hit, um, you're looking 
really, really good, really crisp, and um, you know, I'm pretty excited for you. you know, I, I know you're excited, and uh, I could be more proud of you, man. This whole prep, um, you've done a really a terrific job, and uh, you know, based off of you know your your prior showing, um, you know, you've already won, dude, and you know, no matter the placing, um, you know. I'm sure you're gonna be pretty proud, and, and um, you know, of course, uh, it's just still just one small step in your journey. You got a long road ahead. Um, very young. There's a ton of potential still, um, you know. But uh, but now it's like here's the show. We're gonna focus on this show. So it's time for meal number two. We are two and a half hours out for the registration. He's gonna have a meal in. Um, so we got here the pastrami beef, 150 grams. Oh yeah, that's definitely almost right. Baked potato. Hey. So put in some olive oil, measure it out. Three grams. Oh yeah, pastrami beef, belly meats, cooking. Let's get this one out, this baby here. Okay, pastrami beef in. Oh shit. So, that's one. Now presentation is key, ladies and gentlemen. Michelin start cooking here. But one day out. And you know bodybuilders often are gonna tell you, hey, what's your secret? Well, broccoli and chicken. So what's your secret? Yeah, just uh, some uh, chef style pastrami beef and uh, baked potato with salt, a lot of sodium. Serious, serious. Four grams of olive oil. Extra salt. Ooh, it's gonna be a salty meal. High sodium, baby. Mm. Bam, bam, bam. Give it another taste. Only the pastrami. Wow. Wow. So we just finished our pastrami beef with high sodium baked potato. Now let's see what's happening with my body. You will see what happened. Tights up.
You have seen me cooking, you have seen me eating this stuff. Broccoli, chicken. Why? Why, dude? I saw the meals. <laughs> so we are now going to the athletes meeting. There are a lot of competitors inside. So we're gonna take a look. It's gonna be awesome seeing every competitor that's sitting in my class. Let's see. I was planning to eat another potato with pastrami, but you know, I was looking at a protein bar. Like, ah, I'm gonna have some candies. It's the coolest looking dude, anyway. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Thank you. How are you doing, Mike? Where are you Good, from? Man. The Netherlands. The Netherlands. Yes. Okay. Okay. So, and you competing? No, no, I'm a coach. I'm a coach. Oh, you're I don't compete. Coach. I don't compete. Yeah. Which which country? Australia. 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 Okay. Yeah. So if, you, if you're as good in this as you are in in football, you're good. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna enjoy this lovely protein bar here. It was just way more convenient, right, than cooking another meal. So why not? Having candies. Mmm. 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 So let's sit with the athletes, man. Just check out a little bit. Ninety to one hundred competitors from Australia. It's crazy. <laughs> they have a, such a big team. Hey, how are you, man? How are you? Good. Yeah, good. Yeah. <laughs> That's Basem. Basem is the organization of the INBA Middle East. Perfect. How are you? I'm having Yeah, it's yeah. correct. I'm having a good time. Thank you very much. Following the YouTube channel. Yeah, I'm following the YouTube channel. Awesome. Good. This man is ridiculously big. He's a pro natural bodybuilder. You can see the conditioning of this guy. He scares the shit out of everybody, man. That's the beauty. You don't see it throughout the shirt, but holy. Oh, we get tested by the WADA regulations, and everybody that walks around here, we just the first class directly goes into this room. So let's take a look. Everyone here is waiting for to be drug tested. Just to let show show you guys that it, this everybody gets tested, okay? So it's not just a regular natural bodybuilding show. It is definitely tested. So we we have to pee. Acknowledgement, natural day. There's an agreement with the organization itself that I'm completely natural and uh, that I will be in court if I am trying to mislead somebody or somehow. But uh, I don't think so. Just keep hydrated, we go. They can be patient with us. Thank you. So you're going to wear this for your dude. You're just going to wear that right now. And for tomorrow, you're going to wear this to get in. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Pleasure. Always a pleasure. Don't worry. Or you're down low. On a down low. That's good. I appreciate it. On a down low. We're going to record. Time for drink testing, baby. I need to pee very badly. So I'm keeping it on. This is how it's done, baby. Boom. Oh. 
Dude, I'm I'm freaking exhausted. They're still registering the men's bodybuilding. What was expected to be one hour is now taking two to two and a half hours. We are almost done with the blood test and your analysis. And then we're gonna eat some good food. We have a Coca-Cola light. Number nine. 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 How old are you? Age? Age? 24. The Choose one. Six million ways to die. Choose one. <laughs> Red wine, baby. Red wine. I'm gonna eat some red meat today just to fill out the uh, red blood vessels again. The blood test is done. You see it, everything is ready. Now time for food, relaxation, tomorrow is the show. I'm gonna make it happen man. So doing some mandatory poses. This is one day before the show. It was a long day. I'm tired, so uh, we have also constructed the uh, posing session itself of 60 seconds posing routine. We just did it in five minutes and it was uh, completely uh, organized. So first off, compulsory poses, mandatory poses, so.
So just tricep pose, gonna show off hamstring here. Turn around again, get into the tricep, stretch it out, and twist. Let's break the whole biceps. Glutes. Christmas tree. Turn around. Abs and ties. Hands on hips, most muscular. And no more muscular. On the side. We have front double biceps still and from last breath, yeah, forgotten. Freaking light. Is it good? Mm hmm. Yeah. Bring it together. Squeeze. And that will be it. Posing routine. Gotta give that a check. Ooh. It's getting hot in here. start off with a muscular hands on hips. But this is approximately the pose routine, so finished. Oh man. It was an exhausting day. So tomorrow morning we will turn up, cook all our meals, and uh, get ready for the show. And we'll do our best and have our Pizza. So, uh, time to rest now a little bit, get a shower, chill out, have a Coca Cola light, and uh, just chill out a bit, man, because today was an exhausting day. So, one more shake to go, and then uh, we'll be sleepy, sleepy time.
Ladies and gentlemen, one day out. Let's do this. You got me slow dancing. You got me slow dancing. Someone to belong to let me be Now that you're there for a moment I don't care what's gonna happen to me And I keep spinning to all I see is you You pull me into the unknown where nobody right now we still have to eat a crazy color here good stuff getting our first meal in here pastrami look at this shit crazy let's see how my potatoes are oh they're pretty much done Three hundred fifty grams carbohydrate. We are ready, brother. Jaws are checked. Timing. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh oh yeah. Oh no. Lady, are you ready? <laughs> are you ready? I'm definitely ready. I think you are ready. Oh, yeah. Good morning. The show starts at 9 o'clock. Yes, yes. Inshallah, 9 o'clock. Sure. I will see you there. <laughs> Thanks, sweetheart. You have a great day. Good luck. Thank you. Bye. Bye bye. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So we're taking a cat taxi cab to the venue. So welcome. This is the uh, dome, sports dome in Dubai. Good morning. Okay. We get good. We get it here. Yeah, very good. <laughs> you are ready. You are ready. I'm ready. Good. Yes. Feeling good. The temperature is good here. Yes, not too cold. nice temperature. Was, not was, too hot. Yeah, but also not too cold. Not too cold. I, yeah. I think it was too conditioned. Yeah. Too air conditioned. Yeah. Yes. Crazy. Soft floor. Good uh, temperature here. Everybody's laying down. Backstage waits over there. People getting tanned up. Yeah, you can see the competitors. It's good. Slept well? Yeah. Good. Yeah. Just, just five, six hours, but it's, it's enough. It's, it's enough. enough. <laughs> just having my cup of coffee and everything is okay, man. Wonderful. Good. You got that cup of coffee good. Oh, man. I love it. All right. Then I will be eating the pizzas, man. Yes, you will. <laughs> man right here. <laughs> This guy was the biggest motivation for me. I've been following him on Facebook. Yes. I really loved your post. You are a very positive man. Thank you very much. You have been a very big motivation for me. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet you in reality. Which, which competition are you? Uh, I'll be doing bodybuilding master and uh, overall bodybuilding. Everything that comes yeah. up. Ready? We'll let you know ahead of time. Sure. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Nice man. We're looking forward. How late do you need to get on stage? Uh, I think we'll be the first class. 
first class. Yeah, first class at no, nine. I nine thirty. We make sure we'll we'll we will let you on the make sure they won't get you. Oh really? We'll sure. make sure they won't get you. That would be great. Nice to meet you. Thank you very much. Nice to meet you. Thank you. We're getting things done, you know, it's, it's just so lovely to meet new people. Awesome. So, we are just arrived at the venue, we're looking at the conditioning here. As you can see, I'm getting very vascular. Wow. Yeah! Woo! It's keeping the body warm. Because that's the trick for me. For vascularity. Taking some salt. some salt here. Been waiting for someone, someone to belong to let me be. Now that you're there for a moment, I don't care what's gonna happen to me. And I keep spinning till all I see is you. You pull me into the unknown where nobody's gone before. Anybody? Anybody? Good one. 
Front of the basket, front of the basket, and score. Relax, 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 boys. Okay, turn around, all turn around. A read right of the basket, striking one half, and score. Read of the basket, striking one half, and score. Relax, face the foot. Can I get all the boys to go back to the right line? All the way back, go okay. back. Competitor 227 come forward. Competitor 88 come forward. One nine ten come forward. One two four. Three one three. Three one three. Come forward. Sixty seven come forward. One one nine come forward. One one nine come forward. Close the back. Close the gap. Close the gap. Side chest, side chest, and strike. Relax. Stay on the right line. Stay on the right line, boys. And for your favorite pose, your favorite pose, and strike. Your favorite pose, and strike. getting into the recap of the show just gonna take a look here at my conditioning right now and of course get some posing in you might wonder Rico you had a red posing trunk on ladies and gentlemen this is my condition Juist, even blijven staan. Ja? Ja. Alles stond hè? Alles. Alles erop? Of ga je het van beneden naar boven? Van beneden naar boven. Dat je echt die aderen ziet. Dus 
Dat is God voor domme goederen, man. Alles op, This is the conditioning right now, ladies and gentlemen, we have not placed in the top five. They were standing humongous people on, uh, against me. Uh, I'm freaking satisfied. Uh, satisfied? I don't even know what I'm talking here. I'm freaking, uh, how do you call that? Disappointed. Disappointed, man. I've put in six months of freaking hard work and dedication and yes of course everybody's aiming for this everybody you know but I was so expected to place pretty good actually and we didn't place out of all those guys I thought I brought in my best shape I think I brought in my best shape but uh, just coming in as a rookie in the senior class and then you see you're overmastered by all the people that are training for so long. You know, but uh, I don't know what to say, man. It's a huge disappointment. And this reminds me of Jeff talking to me right now, saying, Rico, no matter what the placing is, this is right now, right now happening. I can remind myself that Jeff said to me, Rico, it's not about the placing. It's about the whole journey and the experience, you know. And this actually gives me some rest in my head right now at this single point. Because it's true. It's true, it's been a journey for six months. I came in in the best shape of my life, Jeff. I want to thank you for that, 3 MJ. All the people around me involved, my parents, the cameraman, everybody. And we keep going. We keep going. Gonna have an off season right now just to get in some mass and to actually be able to compete with these guys. People right next to me were standing in the same height class with 100 kilograms on stage. Now whether or not this is natural or not, I am not here to judge, but uh, give you a fair opinion here. I'm 67 kilograms and someone who is standing with 33 kilograms more muscle. That's the freaking 50% what's on my freaking body. Freaking body. 30 kilograms heavier. No standard chance. You can come in with the conditioning you want. You're not gonna win, man. Now gonna enjoy some uh, good hamburgers. Enjoy with my parents, with you, Robin Fieselman. Pizza, pizza, dude. <laughs> Next time I will come for you, baby. Shit. 
So, finally, first, first, first restaurant we are visiting here after the show and six month back preparation. Starting off with IHOP. Now I'm gonna order a shitload of food. I'm probably gonna feel very bad. Tonight we're gonna have steak or something else we don't know yet. The menu. First situation where we, we go to eat. Okay. I'm gonna start off with big steak omelet. We're gonna take some pancakes in a stack. And savory chicken Florentine crepes. <laughs> and that's pretty much it for today. I think tomorrow we're gonna have some IHOP too. We're gonna taste some other stuff. And maybe if there's still room left over, one of the cheesecake or something. It's worth a lot of calories. Yeah. We'll wash it off with water. Have you done that? You just broke Ooh, peanut butter bacon. Oh, oh that is it. Nah, blueberry is not lekker. Wie for my hand. It's gonna be peanut butter bacon and old fashioned. Good ice coffee, Rico. Oh, ice coffee, yeah, sure, why not? You know? <laughs> Sugar bombs. Wow. <laughs> this is life. Life came to me again. <laughs> Oh, really? Okay, it's gonna be ice coffee for me. <laughs> hey, that bloemetje van Jood aan, Alex. Nice to bacon. Goh, ik verlang wel uh, om uh, weer normaal naar buiten te kunnen. Maar meestal is het lekker hè? dat je gelijk in de taxi, uit de taxi, Yo, krijg ik dit ook bij. Hier, nog één. There's only one mission of this day. Ending off with a bloated belly. Lying on my bed, not able to stand up. Also tomorrow. I know I'm gonna feel very sick. But hey. Dadelijk, alleen maar fast food. Kijk, 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 Robin, komt ie. Oh. oh, you made my day. Oh, ladies and gentlemen. Ik heb nog een garlic bread. Oh ja. Het is wel een hot. Dank je Pancakes. 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 Yeah. This is not normal. Cheese. Taste this one.
first time in my life I hopped Best pancakes ever, man. Healing. So we have finished the plate with the crepes. My dad couldn't finish the omelette, which I have already eaten uh, like this portion already. Finishing this one, the pancakes. And this one. And the garlic. Why not? No need it. That. I'm gonna stuff that one too. It's gonna be one hell of a journey but uh, just gonna stuff it down I feel like shit And we were just hitting IHOP, which was already in the planning to uh, do some eating. And I pinched ridiculous. And my stomach right now is completely up, although you don't really see it. You know, but it feels like shit. <sighs> no IHOP, pancakes, omelette, things I usually don't need. Binge Factor 2.0, maybe. But it was good, to be honest. But now I feel like shit. And now I'm going to the toilet and get myself a peaceful stomach again. gonna binge today? No, I'm just gonna have a little bit of uh, the Cheesecake Factory here. You know, just enjoying some life, man. So, he's hot, Tomer. To the alien. Oh, here, here's she. This is here's she. So, I'm gonna need one. I don't know man, but it's gonna be, the Oreo looks a little bit, you know, I am familiar with Oreo, but I definitely got to choose from this one or this one, but I don't know, I want to freaking eat it all of it. The first cheesecake, we have eaten a lot of food, but this 
is my very first cheesecake that I'm gonna take in. This is the Hershey's chocolate one, and we got an Oreo cookie milkshake here. Man, it's gonna be a feast. Flexible dining. Flexible dining <laughs> on this maximum rate. So let's give it a taste, right? First, I'm gonna, gonna nip some of this, this, this Oreo milkshake. And no drink. Please. Oh, gin. Gin. Okay. Here. This is a smooth criminal. Smooth criminal. Minimal, man. Oh, so be your visa. This is echt lekker. Stop it. Enough. It was it you? Was good? Sugar dip. <laughs> Somebody needs to sleep, baby. <laughs>